This is third in a series of video tutorials for World Editor from Laminar Research. Starting a new airport from scratch. If instead you'd like to create an airport from scratch, you'll need to open the airport menu and click Create Airport. Because of the high quality of airport data included in X-Plane, it is most common to simply import existing data. You'll notice now a new item in the hierarchy pane at the top right of your drafting window titled Unnamed Entity. Double click this item and give it the same name as your airport. From here you'll need to enter some of the basic information about your airport in the editing pane beneath the hierarchy pane including name, elevation, and ICAO identifier. You can find this information online using the AirNav database at http colon forward slash forward slash airnav.com forward slash airports. It's a good time to note here that World Editor can work in either units of meters or feet. To select what you would like to work with, go to the View menu and check either feet or meters. When you're getting data from websites, such as the AirNav database, be sure to note in which units the data is given. If you need to switch between the two at any point, World Editor can simply convert all the numbers for you when you select the new units. From here on, we'll be assuming that you will be modifying existing airport data to create your airport. 